Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today, I'll be unboxing Luxbell Selfie Stick Telescopic Pole. Uh, before I do that, I would like to mention that uh, just a few days ago or a few weeks ago, I, I did a review of the XC Source uh, adjustable self lock uh, telescopic pole or monopod, which is right here. And the difference between uh, the XC Source, which I'm holding right here, and the Lux Bell, which is right here, and I'll be unboxing shortly, is that the XC Source can be extended up to 47 uh, inch and this is uh, act as a monopod as well and uh, so it has more uh, and this this is a little bit uh, heavier than the Luxbell selfie stick telescopic pole now this one is uh, when you're folded the folded length is 15.75 inch but when you extend it it can go up to 47.24 inch so this is much bigger than the smaller one i have here which i'll be unboxing so i'll provide a link of uh, the xc source telescopic pole and you'll be able to watch it and uh, we'll start with our lux bell unboxing right now Okay, so here's the box. Uh, it looks like before opening, it says Lux Bell Selfie Stick uh, Telescopic Pole, and as you can see, it's a uh, 6.6 .6 inch when it's folded, and it can be extended up to 18.1 inch. So the advantage of this one is that uh, you can have uh, you can put it in your purse or you can put it in your uh, jacket pocket because it's only 6.6 .6 inch however it cannot uh, act as an uh, as a monopod just like the other one XC source I mentioned before so we'll just go ahead and start unboxing right now and see what's this all about Okay, so looks like I don't need a knife. Okay, so here we have one purse. And let's see if there's anything else inside the box. Looks like, yes, there's something else. I'll put it in here. And we have something else which I'll put in here and I'll just leave the box here uh, for now and let's open up this one right here first okay so this is a uh, action camera attachment uh, Tool. So what you can do is that you can attach your action camera on top of the telescopic pole just like the way it's shown here. So this part would mount on the top of the pole and then you put your action camera in here and then you just attach this to hold it on top of it. So I'll set this aside here and let's open up this one okay so this is the part that uh, holds your cell phone so it's just like actually this looks like this another hole in here not oh, okay so this this one looks like uh, fixed it doesn't fit 
Okay, so I'm not sure you can extend this or not. There should be something to extend it. But okay, so I can't I can see anything uh, that can extend it right away. So maybe I'll check this later. For now, I don't want to break it, so I'll just put it aside here. If you remember my other video for the XC Source uh, telescopic pole, the cell phone attachment uh, tool, which is this one, was very uh, flexible, and I was able to figure it out right away uh, and how to put, put the cell phone inside it. But this one looks like a little bit different. So I'll just put it aside for here. And now, I'll just go ahead with uh, this one. Okay, so here is what we have. So we have a small six inch uh, uh, selfie stick. And I'll just go through some of the uh, features of this. So this is very lightweight, aluminum made, and it has a rubber uh, grip and then it's a uh, looks like very light and you can easily put it in your uh, purse or pocket according to the manufacturer this should be 5.3 ounce which is almost like having nothing and it can retract to 7 inch so let's try that okay so here you go so this is the maximum you can retract this to. Now, okay, I, I'm gonna have to say that the feeling of this is not that you know sturdy or strong feeling. It when you open it and when you hold it, it looks like uh, you know it's gonna. It's gonna break it easily so it's not that durable however if you remember the other XC source uh, selfie stick it had that feeling that you know it was durable but this one it's very uh, lightweight though but you know it's not that durable and it doesn't give you that feeling that you know it's gonna last long and then the way you uh, so when you extend it so it you know moves a little bit and in order for you to lock it looks like you have to just uh, pull and turn right to lock okay so yeah so if you turn it to the right then that locks it and then if you turn it to the left then unlocks it which actually I I don't like this feature it's you know it's kind of confusing and even when you lock it it looks like a little bit shaky okay and then here we have uh, a wristband which you can put it on your uh, which you can use to put it on your wrist and you can actually it looks like this one okay okay here so you can loosen it up here and you can make the size smaller or larger based on your own wrist okay so I'll just lock it for here okay even when you uh, try to open it you know it's not just uh, it's not that easy to maneuver I'm gonna have to say that you know it's a uh, kind of not easy to open and not easy to close okay the foam grip is okay but you know it has a, that some sort of uh, feeling that it's not very uh, 
it's not very good material it gives you the cheap feeling but comparing to my other XC source which gives you you know very good feeling a good grip but this one you know it gives you a very cheap feeling it's not not something you know you want to hold on to for longer or doesn't feel good when you hold it and even when uh, even the uh, hole here if you want to mount it on top of something you know it looks like very cheap it's okay it's right here so this one but if you take a look at this one you know it it has that nice uh, or good quality feeling or good quality build but comparing to this one this one I wouldn't say I wouldn't be confident you know with this item okay okay so if you want to put your uh, digital camera or uh, video camera or handy cam or point and shoot cam th that type of camera then what you have to do you have to put this attachment right here and then you tighten this up by putting the screw inside okay for some strange reason um, let me see it's not just you know clicking right away so it's kind of difficult to put this in here and screw it okay so here here you go okay so what you have to do if you want to put your uh, handy cam or digital camera point and shoot camera then you piece together these uh, tools and then you put your camera on top of it right here so that's how it's gonna hold your uh, video camera or point and shoot digital camera okay I was able to figure out how to use this so you have to pull this harder I didn't pull it initially because I was thinking that you know this is gonna break so if you pull this then you slide your phone like this way however when you pull it it makes noise and it gives you that feeling that is gonna break so you know I'm not confident pulling this too much and even if I pull up to this level I can hear like clicking sound and it feels like you know it's breaking so definitely not a quality product so this one uh, I'm not sure how long it's gonna last uh, it doesn't give you that you know confident feeling that you know it's gonna last uh, for months or years to come however this is not an expensive product so I even if it doesn't that last last uh, does last that long that you know I have nothing to complain about but on the other hand the XC source I had before actually this one is cheaper than this one and it looks like more durable and more uh, a better material uh, which it was built with so here's the that's all I have here so if you want to buy this my recommendation would be look for something else first uh, maybe you would be paying a little bit more money than this one but I'm not confident with this purchase and overall I'm not confident with the quality and the material so 
uh, please keep an eye, eye on this channel and if you like what you see please give it a thumbs up and remember that uh, my opinions are always unbiased and honest and these reviews or any reviews on um, uh, my channel are not paid for by any companies so you will get always you can count on you know the opinions and the review i'm providing you so please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and i'll see you shortly thank you